For somebody who's their very first time or having an injection, I like to use Refine versus its sister product, which is Define. Once you become a diehard and love your lips, mm -hmm. you'll get a little bit more time out of Define, but it's a little heavy and it's a little thick. It's not a great first time. Though. Okay. Um, but if you love it, and once you kind of get used to it, your lips will feel like somebody else's for about a week or so. Okay. okay. So today you're going to be swollen. Mm -hmm. um, you may be bruised. Mm -hmm. um, you will probably be like, oh my God, I hate them. They're too big. Okay. Um, and then they get a little bit lumpy and a little bit uneven. But by like day three or four, you'll be like, oh my God, this is great. Okay. And then, yeah, I saw your little like... The little thing, yes. the little journey. Yes. And that is so hands on for everybody. I mean, it's just like to the T. Mm -hmm. It's gonna take me about 15 minutes, 20 minutes to inject. Um, I inject very, very slowly. This technique um, I learned last fall. I mean, I've been injecting lips for, you know, 30 years, but um, this girl, Julie Horn over in Oslo, who is just, in my opinion, the lip queen of the world. I mean, she's just unbelievable. So it's kicked up my lip game a lot. Um, yeah, I've been following you for a long time. Have you? I love all the work you do. Oh, yeah. thank you. That's yeah, so I'm so comfortable. I'm not nervous. Oh, good. Yeah. Well, that's great. Yeah. Yeah. They're, I just want them all around bigger. Okay. So when I see you right now, you have what we call the golden ratio, which is your upper lip is about one third of the size of your lower lip. Yeah. Which is really aesthetically pleasing. Oh. Although I would like to give you a little bit more upper lip. See how you're kind of going inside your mouth? Yeah. So I think oh, I that, love that to give you more like that, and then again, we're going to have to do that to your mm -hmm. lower lip too. 